Tristan, one can only hope, but we had to stop to have a look at this gorgeous lilac breasted roller sitting in the lovely light. Isn't that so beautiful? There we go. There's a fantastic screenshot that you should be able to get. This bird is very attentive. There's some go away birds just calling into the distance. They've just settled down now, so I wonder if it is listening to the go away birds, or perhaps it's listening to my voice and wondering if I'm also going to pay it a compliment. Isn't that an amazing close up? That is so beautiful. Look at all those different colors that they've got. You know, you really don't see them unless you are up close like this. We've got lilac, we've got, of course, that's where I get their name from, a bit of turquoise, browns and purples, white, black, a little bit of black. Isn't that very pretty? Oh, there we go. Well, you now know what it looks like to see down a bird's throat. <laughs> that's a good thing. If only I was a, um, what do they call it? ENT, uh, ears? What, oh my goodness, what am I trying to say? Uh, ears, nose and throat specialist. There we go, that's what I needed to be, an ENT, to have a look at that. I think this bird is on the lookout for some insects, though, the way that it has perched itself at the top of this tree. That's typically what the rollers do, and they will look for their prey either down on the ground or even as it's flying, and they will try and catch it. And they don't eat it on the wing like some birds do, they actually bring it back to a perch and then we'll feed on it there. Oh, now you're going to have a scratch. Careful you don't poke your eye out with your little toenails or your claws. Holding on tight. I thought I heard some southern ground hornbills for a minute, but I don't think it was. No, it doesn't sound like it's them calling. Isn't this so lovely? I believe you saw a purple roller the other day with Tristan. Mm. Very nice. I started seeing them when I was on holiday which is very cool to see, of course, see the cousin. Now we just need to wait for the lilac breasted roller. And who knows, this year, will we get a broad build roller on screen? They will have to be one of my favorite rollers. Purple with yellow beaks. Actually, while you look at it, I'm going to very quietly try and find a picture for you because they're so stunning. Let me go to R for roller. Mm, I need to get used to this book again. Let's go, 264. <laughs> Kirk, you say that the colors look great on this bird. If you wore them, they would clash. Ah, oh, I think anybody that had, had feathers of this color would look beautiful. Don't sell yourself short. What was I looking for again? The rollers. Yes, rollers. Should I show you the cousin very quickly and then we'll see if it's still around. Do you approve of a broad bill roller? Lilac breasted roller? They're very difficult to spot. We did, I did see some in 2015 when I started guiding down in the sands and then I used to see them a lot in Zambia as we were quite fortunate they were a very very common bird. They're beautiful. Oh no, well no don't worry, the book's not going to go anywhere, this one down at the bottom over here is the one we're talking about, the broad build roller, bright yellow beak, purples, a little bit of browns, but that purple is so striking and you also can't miss them with that very sort of broad yellow yellow bill 